Hi everyone, welcome to another one of my home renovation series. This is episode 8, I believe, and if you've not watched my videos before, then hi. I'm Emma, me and my husband are renovating this three bedroom house to eventually live in. Feeling a bit of stress today. I don't know why, just little things are beginning to annoy me and we've got a lot going on. But anyway, I thought I'd update you with the latest updates so far. So last episode, me and my mum started painting, which I'm so happy about. And David's parents actually came around this week to start on some of the other rooms. Well, one of the other rooms, I should say. Let me show you. You might be able to hear some music because David's already touching up in the spare room which me and my mum made start on last week but I'm in the other spare room now towards the back of the house which David's mum and dad painted this week so yeah it's looking good it's had a couple of coats on the walls and on the ceilings there's just some little bits I can see which just need touching up so I'll start doing that in a minute also, this morning before we came over to the house, we actually went to a carpet shop. So we've got some carpet sa shop samples, samples, which I can also show you now too. So we just went to one of our local carpet shops in the town closest to us. And yeah, the guy's gonna come around on Monday to start measuring up. I don't know if I've mentioned it before, in case I haven't, we're gonna get carpet in all of the three bedrooms upstairs on the landing and going down the stairs as well. Downstairs I want wooden flooring, but I'll, I'll leave that to discuss another day because this guy only does carpets. But anyway, I just wanted to show you the samples because I asked for some samples, if you can hear me above the music, I asked for some samples to try and, you know, have a look around in each room because there's different rooms and different lights. Carpets can look different, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, I'll show you these carpets. I asked for a sample and look, I got a whole book. <laughs> But that's what he's called it anyway, a book of carpets. <laughs> so they're quite large. Quite nice of him to just lend us uh, this because we can just take it around the house, like I said. Um, these are the ones we've just discounted already, whereas these ones are, yeah, options. So all quite neutral. I think the first one actually is too dark, but I'll show you. If I think we're trying to decide between these two at the moment. And after I've done some painting, I'll show you what they look like in each room because this one looks quite light in this light, but of course going down the stairs it looks a bit darker. This one looks like a darker grey, but in some lights it can look blue, so yeah, really odd. Anyway, I'll show you that in a minute, I should really get on with painting now. <laughs> the camera much admittedly because there was me, David and David's parents in the house and it felt a bit not chaotic but when there's loads of people in the house it's hard to pick up the camera and film everything that's been going on so anyway yeah we've been doing some touching up in the two spare rooms and we've also been painting the radiators we've also put the skirting boards back on on the spare rooms as well in the spare rooms as well so just going to show you those because the room looks a lot better with those back on so this is just a little spare room here. I can't, I'm not, I'm not sure if you can remember from my last video, but um, yeah, these were off and it does just feel so much better now that they're back on. They were just screwed on. So these uh, little gray bits, again, they're just from, they're just some filler on there. So once that's all dry tomorrow, we're gonna sand it down and paint those because I did go to B&Q earlier and buy some primer and undercoat wood a primer and undercoat paint for wood here and just some satin wood here as well so these were quite expensive that was like 36 quid each or something but anyway it'll be worth it once that's all on and just for the sake of it I'll show you in here as well I painted that radiator that's why it's in the middle of the room but yeah skirtings are back on there's just one missing over here because that's going to get replaced because it basically had a plug socket or used to be a plug socket here and had the plug socket cut out of it. So it needs to be replaced. Ah, but yes, it's all coming together slowly, which is making me feel a lot better. Even these window seal tile things we've painted as well. Eventually we want to get window seal covers on those, but just getting some white paint on them just feels so much nicer, so much brighter. So that's me for today anyway, and we'll be coming back here tomorrow.
Morning, it's Sunday, actually Father's Day today. My dad might be coming round later <laughs> to help us with the house, but apparently he's quite happy to do that. But anyway, back at the house today and I realised yesterday I didn't show you the carpet and the different light lightings and different rooms and stuff, so I think I'll show you that now quickly if you're interested. So this is at the bottom of the stairs, these two we're thinking about going with. As you can see what I said yesterday, sometimes this dark grey one can look quite blue in different lights. So yeah, I, I mean this looks quite light here, but let's just have a look in other rooms. Hopefully this comes up on camera, but I've just put it on the top of the stairs as well. And you can see that this looks not as light and it still kind of looks bluey, bluish, but um, yeah, completely different colours. Let's just try one of the rooms. So this is our main bedroom. I think this is the room that gets most light because it's self-facing. Yeah, they look different again. I think I am going more with this one. Let me know what you guys think. Which one do you prefer? Or maybe you've caught another one, caught the eye of another one of these shades back here. Let me know in the comments. I'm just waiting for my mum to come around because she's helping us again today. And I just keep on looking at the rooms which have been painted and I just can't get over how nice they look now. Like I was really worried, worried that you could see all the bumps and, and stuff like that in them. But we've done a really good job and the white paint just makes it feel like new. Like I love it. The painted radiators are also get looking good. This one might just need one more coat because it was like yellow beforehand. But yeah, even they have come up quite nicely. Anyway, plan for today. Sorry, there's some hoovering going in the other room, so I've come in here. We're going to be painting the skirting board, so we need to sand them down first, apply the undercoat and primer. Depending on how long that will take to dry, then we can put on the satin uh, layer coat on it. <laughs> I'm just gonna paint, gosh, what do you call that thing? It's not a lid. <laughs> what is the name of this thing? I'm just gonna paint it white as well as we've got those undercoats. part of the day so just to show you what's been happening my mum has put the first coat of paint on the hallway ceiling I'll just turn the camera around so yeah that looks good and also a coat of undercoat on the oh god I am at a loss of words today basically the skirting around the hatch is that what you'd call it the hatch for the attic I've obviously put an undercoat on here as well for the hatch opening I don't even know but yes, and um, some undercoat on the skirting in both of the spare rooms as well. If you can see some light little yellow bits and pieces, that's just wood filler where there was either screw or nail holes in there. But yeah, it is coming along. I really, I feel like this weekend, and I think David said the same thing as well, it's the first weekend coming to the house where you can actually see it really moving forward now and really coming together. So yeah, feeling quite happy and optimistic that you know, it's all going to start coming together now, especially as we get more rooms painted and the carpets will eventually be laid and all of that kind of stuff. Just, yeah, feel like I'm in a good mood and we've been really productive this weekend, so yay! <laughs> anyway, I hope you've enjoyed watching this video as always and if you have enjoyed it, please let me know by giving me a thumbs up. If you've not subscribed to my channel and you want to keep up to date with this renovation project then please subscribe before you go and yeah as always if you guys have any thoughts or on what we're doing or what we should be doing please leave some comments in the comment section below I'd love to hear from you guys but like I always say thank you so much for watching especially if you made it this far I will see you in my next video bye